Hi everybody, it's Katz from So Sweet Charms and I'm bringing you the continuation of our previous video when I was with my daughter. We were discussing on the project that she wanted to create with the wallet from So Craftastic's website or her video channel. So take a look for her. I'll put a link below and subscribe to her as well to us and you'll get to see cool projects. These are the two colors that my daughter decided to use and it's duct tape brand and we purchased these at Walmart but you can find them at any local craft store in your town um, as well as Walmart. So we bought these at Michael's because we were in the area and that was the quickest way to get to them but they have maybe about 30 different patterns um, from cupcakes to Paris to jelly beans to paint to Hello Kitty uh, One Direction so you can the possibilities of the wallets are endless. So we made the trifold wallet like I said um, on So Craftastic. She'll have all the measurements that you need and it's step-by-step -step video so I will send a link below so that you can see it and this is basically the end of our project and I think it turned out fantastic it is super cute as well as super strong and durable um, the quality of this tape is unreal and if you feel it it's it's not flimsy at all so this is how it looks when it's fully open that's the inside pockets um, she did them in black pockets and I just decided to continue the, the color combination and do some trims on it. So I did it a little bit different than how she did it but I think it turned out super sweet. So I'm just going to bring that in closer for you. As you can see in here in the middle is the ID pocket and what I use for that is a CD cover um, or a movie cover and I just cut it to size and then applied it in there. What she used was a prop Pro, um, project protector sorry about that um, and she still found that it wasn't the right quality so I recommend to use the CD covers it's a lot thicker plastic um, and it is bendable and it doesn't leave a crease in the center as well as we have these side pockets and in behind them have uh, hidden pockets so I'm just going to show you how the cards fit in quite easily just bear with me because I'm used to this camera thing not getting used to this camera thing so first pocket We'll hold the card just like that. And then we have a behind pocket and it can be a fully hidden card or if you want it to hang out so you can see that it's completely hidden and it still stays nice and closed. And then as well as we have the ID pocket and again you can use it for IDs, oh, oops, IDs or for your driver's license as well as pictures. So I'm pretty sure Caitlin will be putting a picture of mommy and daddy, I hope. And then in behind there, I have a hidden pocket as well. So I'm just going to show you with the other card what I mean. So I will put, sorry about that, I'm going to put the one in the ID and then this card is just behind there. So it's a little hidden pocket and in behind there is a super huge large area to hold your bills. And I think this wallet is definitely worth the time and effort that you put into it. Um, just follow along. It's super easy. It took me about an hour to make or so because I had to pause a couple of times just to make sure that I was understanding the instructions that she was giving me as well as the measurements that were correct. So that's basically our wallet. Fold it up. There you go. Or you can fold it the other way, whichever way you prefer. And that's how it turned out. And I think it turned out fantastic. And I know my daughter's going to love it. So thanks, everybody. I hope that you subscribe and give us a big thumbs up if you like this project and how it turned out. And if you want to see any other styles of wallets, I'll definitely be doing some more because I'm definitely doing one for me um, since I loved how this turned out. And like I said, the quality is unreal. And it is waterproof. So if you're caught in the rain, you're good to go. Um, you're not going to have any problems with anything being messed up. So everything will be protected in here. And again, like I said, if you enjoyed this video, give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to our videos. We'll be uh, doing the next videos on our chibi charms that we discussed in the previous video for my husband, which will be Christine from the Phantom of the Opera movie, as well as uh, Elsa from Frozen and Hulk. So the Incredible Hulk. So I hope you enjoy Thanks, everybody, for watching, and we'll see you soon. Take care. Bye.